there would one day come a time when there would be no need for warriors. A time when safety and peace would prevail throughout the land. A time when the priorities of protecting the young and the powerless were firmly in place. And a time when adults had not forgotten our primary reason for being, assuring them all the children are well. I want to challenge us all tonight to have that same fierceness. The same fierceness for the well-being of children in our community, for our children. McCoy, with its staff, its board, its many community partners and allies, are fiercely committed to reducing childhood poverty, to tearing down the barriers of unjust policies and institutions that crush the dreams of way too many of our children, and to walking alongside and empowering the families that want so much for their children to grow up well. We are clearly still living at a time when many of our children are in crisis. And we need more warriors. Warriors who will join us, taking on the responsibility of making sure all our children are well. If we warriors, the caring and committed adults of our community, can fiercely embrace our duty to make sure that every child in this city is cared for unconditionally. Every child has all their basic and developmental needs met, and every child is nurtured and guided to a healthy and happy adulthood. Then, when I ask you, and how are the children, you can all respond to, with one voice, all the children are well. I can't wait for that day to come. Neither can our children. Thank you. to give back to the community, give to organizations 
is like McCoy. Because he goes, I, I sat there and I was wondering and I was writing down these notes and a lot of them only say, but the people, those children mm -hmm. that John talked about, that was me at one time. I came from a middle class family, but I was given an opportunity by someone who saw something in me that I didn't see in myself. And it was organizations that McCoy talks to, that McCoy collaborates with, that McCoy gives back to, and they, and they tell them how to do things differently, and they look at opportunities that they may not see. So this is the part, this is the hook. This is where I ask you to come alongside with McCoy and give of not only your time, but of your resources. So McCoy can further their cause. So McCoy can, at, at some point, we just celebrated 25 years. The end goal is for an organization like McCoy not to exist because all the children are with And when that question is asked, how are the children, we can say that all the children are well. We come together for a completely different reason then. We come to celebrate that all the children are well, not that we are here to raise funds so we can help other children. So, at every table there is an envelope, um, and there's a board member at every table that will pass out the envelopes. And I ask you to reach deep and to do what you can to help this organization to ultimately go out of business. That's the goal. To ultimately put them out of business so we come together to celebrate something else. 